guys, it's Scott here and welcome to today's 6pm content video. Hopefully you do enjoy this one. If you do, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button down below and subscribe for daily streams and videos. We always record these 6pm content videos live on stream, so it's happening right now. So if you want to see those, make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss those when they go live. Uh, we have been having some fun. Uh, we are currently, what, like 12 and 3, something like that, 13 and 3? No. I'm 14 and 3, uh, using our brand new team and it's a lot of fun. Uh, and we are currently just waiting the last few seconds for it to hit 6 o'clock for more foot birthday content. Yesterday, I have to thank you all for the support on the stream and the video. So I really do appreciate all the thumbs up, the subs and all of that good stuff. It was crazy. It has just hit 6 o'clock. What have we got, EA? What have we got? Jordan and Marvi. Interesting. That is very, very good for the French League. Um, is that the only thing that we get, I assume? Oh, no, we get foot 10, so we get Prime Electron Players Pack. So we're going to get one of these each day. Solid. Celebrate foot birthday and build a squad around this timeless player from foot 10. So we'll look at that in a second. But we've got ourselves a Jordan and Marvi card. Now, oh, my God, he's double five star. Wow. So the French League... Doesn't have that many good left backs on this game. We now have a double five star one, which is sick. Uh, his pace is great. His shooting, no one cares. His passing is fine for a fullback. His composure is a little bit low, as is his defensive awareness. Uh, I don't know how much you can boost those up if you put like a Guardian Chem style on him, but both of those are a little bit low. Sadly. His stamina is great. His strength is okay. It's not a great card by any means. Double five star is a lot of fun. But on a left back isn't really that necessary. And he doesn't exactly have the perfect stats to bomb forward and utilize it. So I'm not too sure about this one. You need an 84 and an 85. So this is probably going to come in at um, roughly 100, 150 to 200k, depending on what the market is looking like right now. I'm not entirely sure how it changed after Foot Birthday came out yesterday. So let's quickly have a little look at, for example, Urzil. Urzil's coming in at 210. Oh, okay, no, this is probably going to cost you about 150k at the most uh, for this Amavi card. Maybe closer to 125k because you don't need the informs. So, mm, it's okay. The, the problem is, basically, pretty much the only left-sided League One player that anyone uses is Neymar, and he doesn't strong link to it. If this had been... Markel for Leon. Bernat's obviously already got one. Kazawa, someone like that that gets that Neymar strong link. That could have been really, really good. But I think for most people, this card is not going to be worth it. Sadly, which is a shame because things were looking okay for Foot Birthday. And that's, that's a little bit of a miss uh, right there. Now, the daily objective two today is, I mean, if this is going to be the same every single day, then this is going to be really easy. Play two matches in any foot game mode is exactly what the first objective was. If you just need to play two matches every day, easy as you like, and you can get that complete daily objective package done and earn the final untradeable reward. Uh, doesn't look like anything else got added. I didn't actually get a chance to look at these Yes. Um, wait. Oh, I've already done the bronze. I didn't get a chance to look at them yesterday. Squad battles and then online friendlies. That's fine. Okay, so let's quickly look at the other SBC that we got as well. Uh, wherever that has just gone. Foot 10. So we get a Prime Electron Players Pack for this one. You can link in with Left Wing and Mbappe, but that is one very specific card and a card that isn't dream right now, especially when you can get so many central versions of him. So, Inter Milan Colombian from foot 10. I don't know who that would be. Um, 
Okay, so players from the same league, minimum three. Minimum? Okay. So we could just make a whole Serie A team. That's very, very easy. Ivan Cordoba. I do not remember that card. I didn't really play the first two Ultimate Teams that much, because FIFA 09, I went bankrupt because I didn't, uh, I didn't know how to actually make coins or anything like that. And then Foot 10, I think, was something similar. So, yeah, it could have gone a little bit better for me. Let's go with low to high here. Let's just whack these guys in. So we need to make sure that we don't use more than two from the same club. Um, do we need rares as well? I think we needed like five rares. So we'll just whack a couple in. And if we don't, then we can just take them straight back out. That's fine. And FIFA 11, he had 85 paces as a centre-back. Yeah, I, I just don't remember who that is, to be honest with you. Um, oh no! The left, the left trigger on my controller has suddenly just like stopped working properly. That's that's great news, isn't it? That is absolutely great news. Right up front, we'll whack in these two, and then if we need a rare, then we easily have one up front. Nationality is minimum seven. What have we got? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. We only need two rares, so we'll take out Caldara and just put in a different nation centre-back. Brazilian. And we'll go with Kiracus. Take out De Maio. Oh no, he was a different nation. What about a uh, goalkeeper right here? So, uh... Nope, we literally just put one of you in. What are the odds? Uh... You. Wherever that is. Albania. Perfect. So we get a Prime Electrum Players Pack here. This is a real problem if this is going to keep happening. Um, I'm not expecting for this to have anything close to good inside it. We also, for the daily objective for Foot Birthday 1, got a one rare player pack. Woo! So here we go. Incredible scenes inbound. Imagine if it had been a board, like the hype that could have came out of that, but no, of course it is not. So, and it's a duplicate, untradeable most likely. Yep, sick. The word Electrum kills the pack. Yeah, it's such a shame that basically EA this year love Electrum packs. When it comes to promos, they love 50Ks, 45s, 25Ks. But when it comes to like league SBCs and marquee matchup SBCs and basically any kind of pack rewards for doing squad building challenges, 90 plus percent of them are Electrum packs. And I don't really know why they've done that this year, but it is really annoying. It is really annoying. So let's open this up and see what we get. Again, if you did enjoy today's video, then please make sure to smash the thumbs up button down below. Make sure you subscribe, and again, if you're watching this as a live stream, do the same on here, because we stream every day here. Now on YouTube, we are back home. This is where we belong. So daily FIFA streams is what we're all about, as well as uploading at least one uh, foot video pretty much every day as well. Uh, a Union Berlin player means that that pack wasn't actually that bad, to be fair. Nearly 4,000 coins for a silver player right there is, I guess, a bit of success. So, that could have been a hell of a lot worse for me. Uh, do we get any others? It doesn't look like it. Then again, on me on. I mean, I guess this is the one part about Electrum packs that isn't the end of the world. You have to hit someone that is needed in a league SBC. If you don't then they're trash and you basically just get less value out of all of your cards in your pack. So that sucks. But if you do get lucky like me and you hit someone like that, happy days. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below on this Jordan Amavi card right here. Are you going to do it? Do you think it's worth it? Again, uh, let me very quickly do one last check just to see if his price has come in fully on Footbin. No, it has not. But as I say, it's probably going to be looking like um, around about... 125k uh, to 150k is what I'm expecting for him. So thank you very much for watching this video. It's a shame that we didn't get slightly better content, but I guess it's still a new player SBC to do. 
So thank you very much for watching. We are still going to be live streaming when you have finished watching this video. So come and check us out. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.